Hi you guys, my name is AC Kokui. Welcome to my channel. I have a vlog for you today. I am getting ready. Wow, the lighting's not that great. Okay, good here. I am getting ready for the BET Awards. Now this video was supposed to be something different and it was supposed to go up like before this weekend. So this will be going up after the BET Awards. And um, yeah, so instead of like creating this whole outfit and makeup of what I would have worn to the BET Awards, I'm just gonna vlog. And you're probably like, why is this so important to you? I am absolutely in love with the award shows. Award shows are my favorite thing to do, watch. I love it. So um, I'm a little upset that the BET Awards is virtual this year, but that's not gonna stop the celebration. COVID has stopped a lot, a lot of celebrations this year, but I'm still gonna make fun and have the most fun that I can with this time. You know, just like I did with the Pride video. If you haven't watched that, go watch it right now. And um, yeah, so I'm basically going to get ready. I already just took a shower and now I'm gonna do my makeup and um, put on my outfit. And then I'm gonna go watch it with my best friend and yeah just i guess follow me along my day um yeah okay follow me along my day and let's just have some fun and react to the bt awards together okay all right i'll be back it's not a game it's a rage game So go to the bathroom and show you but I didn't put lashes on because we're just chilling at the house I just put a little like brown and orange 
orange eyeshadow and a little bit of contour and put a lip on and yeah took forever so that's why i had to cut the camera out because it was taking way longer than i wanted and i gotta go so um now i'm just gonna put my clothes on then i'm gonna do my hair i don't know why i'm doing it that way but that's just the way life is telling me to move so <laughs> um yeah okay let me be i'll be focus i'll be right back and then we will i actually need to put one more powder on and spray my face with yeah so i'm gonna finish that and then i'll be back okay so um sorry about the background noise it's just that's the best lighting if i put that light on um so basically i'm gonna yell <laughs> so basically i had this wig it was really nice, but it's getting matted at the end. I only wear synthetic wigs. I'm not there yet. So I cut it. So I decided to cut it. And here we are. I'm still in the process, but it's looking way cuter than what I thought it was going to look. And yeah. Um, okay, let me show you guys. If not, I also just got a new wig. This was a plan before because I didn't think I was going to get here on time. But then I was like kind of excited to still cut it anyway. So here we are. I'm still cutting. You know, it's going to be a little ratchet, but we'll make it work. Oh, uh. oh my goodness. This is not bad at all. I was very, well I am, very over short hair because I, I just had it for like three months, I think, about. And I was like, yeah, no, no more short hair, I'm over that. But I like this because it's not going to, I'm not going to keep this for very long. <laughs> this is so cute and I love the color. And then my makeup looks good with it. Okay, I'm just going to make it a little more even. You see that? It's not the same length. So I'm just going to go around and make this a little more even. I wish you guys could really like... Okay, there's the lighting. That's what I'm looking for. Wow. Wow, there we go. Now you can see what I'm seeing because other way, no. Okay, how do you like it? I'm obsessed. I'm literally obsessed. Yeah, this is, this is the look for today. Who knows when I'll put the other, my other wig on now that I have this. I'm like, taking it in. This is super cute, and especially with this color, my goodness, like I'm obsessed. I don't know. <laughs> I need to do my hair this color, like my real hair, once it gets to the length I want, because that's my plan. I want to go natural in a couple of years, as soon as my hair grows out to the length that I want, so yeah. Nobody knows that though. You guys are the first to know. But yeah, here we go. I am obsessed. This will be the hair. This will be the. I need to take a picture so I remember how I want it colored. Oh, who? Okay, let, let me. Let me. I'll be back. Okay. I guess that my lighting's horrible, so you're not getting the effect that I'm like feeling myself right now. But anyway, um. This is my outfit. Let me show you guys. So if you can see it. I'll show you in better lighting, I guess, outside. But this shirt, I believe it's from Boohoo. These champion pants. Where did I get them? Oh, I think this was a Christmas present. And under, I'm wearing green North Face leggings. Um, 
yeah just to give it that look and then I'm wearing some Jordans not sure if they really go with the rest of my outfit but yeah I, I left my shoes at my friend's house so it's just gonna have to work I like it it's a little different you know than my normal outfits so. Okay, um, so, was with my friend, and now I'm at my other friend's place, and we're, I'm gonna order a uh, Red Lobster, and just get ready. I'm about to actually check what time the BET Awards are, because I don't actually know if it's at 5 or if it's earlier, so let's check that. Okay, it says 3 hours and 46 minutes. Are we able to, um, when you're done, charge my beats? Okay, be mad. Be um, so it's 8 o'clock here. Dang, I'm hungry now. Um, dang. I want to watch it when the rest of the world is watching it at 5. That's why I like, what is it? Com what is this? Comcast. I like your TV for the fact that it's three hours earlier. Okay, so eight o'clock. It's four something right now. I'll probably order Red Lobster at like seven. So for now, I'm hungry. <laughs> and I don't know what to eat. So I really like the lighting. So I'm about to take some pictures because... Yeah, it's too good. Ugh, but I have to do it myself, so let's see. These pictures. I wish I had a camera stand, but I do not. Ooh, I think this might be better. Okay, so I... Ooh, my address is on here. Wow, now all the addresses are on here. Okay. Um, yeah, so I'm going to order Red Lobster from Uber Eats. No, I spell red lobster. There we go. Forty dollars away from zero delivery fee. I may get there. Okay. My dinner went up to thirty-six dollars. They have me so messed up. This is crazy. It comes with the lobster tail, snow crab legs, garlic shrimp scampi. And what's what? This is what I get. I'm so upset. Thirty six dollars for this meal. They have me so messed up. That was so difficult, you guys. I don't even know why. I can't even tell you why. But they just took so many things out of the Red Lobster menu from Uber Eats. But when you go on the regular menu, it's all there. Um, yeah. When you go on the regular menu, it's all there. Everything's there. But I can't apply my code. Because the girl's trying to save money. Um, yeah, so I can't apply my code there, and that's really irritating. And every other app, they say this house is way too far. So I'm irritated, and you know, Precious doesn't want to eat the food. So I just ordered, but I feel bad. <laughs> but yeah, it is now almost 30 minutes to the award show. I'm tired. I literally spent an hour, almost an hour, because I started around 
and I just finished ordering this 724 because it took me that long. But I have my wine and I'm chilling for now. I'm really acting like I'm going to this award show. Kind of. Just the fact that like I'm trying to heavily prepare. <laughs> If she don't sit down, um, go. Precious, I need a card. I don't want this. Okay, you asked her a card? But you keep giving me the card that I gave you. You're holding on to one, two, three places. I'm holding on to one place. And you're being, no, you're holding on to four. You're holding on to four places. You're being rude. And you're being being greedy. Meeting. You're being really Who's greedy. Turn is it? It's mine. There we go. You're being really greedy. Like I'm not holding on to anything, and you're holding on to everything. Your turn. Congratulations. Your turn. Congratulations. It's still the ball in your court. I need a card. Okay. My turn. Go. Who's next? Look at that bad boy. There. That. Look at that bad boy. Look at that. No one cares. No one cares. Okay, can you go? Seriously? Ew. Don't put me in there. Go. Who's next? It's starting. I ordered my food. Now I'm just ready. It's about to start. I don't know why I'm so excited because it's virtual. So who knows how this is about to go? Okay. This is Roddy Rich. Mm -hmm. That beginning was very blackity black black black. It wasn't really funny, but I get it. It's the climate we're in. I love his eyes. I don't like this. This is Why do they have these extravagant like backgrounds? Are they actually going into studios to record this, or are yes. these their, their backyard? No. Chloe and Hallie, they've recorded all their stuff in their backyard. I was like, wow, that must be some extensive backyard you guys have. Oh, it's not a backyard. <laughs> Basically, this is about to be blackity black, black, black. Which I'm not mad at, but it, I, it's going to be very political, I know, because of what's going on right now. Everybody six feet apart. <laughs> Been tough on us okay, we both got honey brown to hair. To mental health to take some time out every day to find some joy, even if that means learning a new language and then using that language to call the Kentucky DA's office. You should do that, or you are the nominees for the best female hip hop artist. Okay, <laughs> oh lord, Doja, Lizzo, Megan, Onika. <laughs> and the winner is It's not gonna be Nikki this year. See, I already know the winner in my head because I don't have, you know, the card, but I'm gonna just act like I have the card. Oh my god, I've probably recorded this video like ten times, so it feels so crazy doing this for five hours. Congrats, but, Megan. See, I cannot believe I won. That's this very deserved. Artist. She uh, worked hard team, last year. Houston, she became Obama, the sensation last year. So uh, most important, thank you, Javi. Here is Masego. Oh, Masego. I only know him because of Arnell Armand. And like that they're friends and they did a video together. And so then I listened to a couple of his songs after that. It's good. Okay, let's debrief. We're already like 30 minutes in. 
I mean, this speech was good. You know, it didn't have that really funny element to it. It was more so like shade ish, like, ooh, 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 moments instead of like, you know, funny. And I don't, I know that this is like what we're going through in the climate. So just, I don't know. I don't know. Like, people want to, I don't know. <laughs> Let me be honest, I just think that past ones have been funny, so it could have been like addressing the ooh moments, but also like a little more um, emphasis on the funny too, you know, because black people, we love laughing, we love, like we're not all about our trauma and stuff like that, and I know that performances and stuff like that we're going to have that element so like having having um both elements to it would have been nice and then i think the performances so far i liked roddy riches a lot john legends was good and the sagos was good so you know we'll we'll see what everybody else has to bring from their backyards or their little studios <laughs> I say too much phone, it's fine. And I was thinking about how the young African American woman with those cord things in her hair. I think they're called braves. Mm. Well, anyways, I said, excuse me, I think they're just born in first class right now. And she whipped around and said, don't assume just because I'm black that I don't belong in first class. You would never. I don't even see color. Van Jones is my whole pass. And then she said, in my own business. Aha, you're all caring. And you need to stop torturing black folks with your fragility. You're not one of us. She's a black! I hate it! <laughs> She's a black! <laughs> I like how she's doing like all the old BT moments, like 106 and Park and now BT News. But that's nice. I love this. I love how she was creative with this and took it to the desert outside. This is so lit. It's like a whole music video. I love this. This is like my favorite performance so far now. <laughs> Like me, like me, them jeans. Oh, them jeans. This is such a good mix. Who did that mix? This is so good. Oh, I'm okay. <laughs> Good job. That definitely took all day. You saw, you see the sun coming down? That took all day for them to film. That was a music video. That was a straight music video. So I got my food. This is how it looks like. It smells great, but the thing does not feel warm at all. So I know this is cold. Yeah, it's very lukewarm, so I'm gonna heat it up. I hate cold food. So yeah, this is the food. It comes with butter. I think this is tartar sauce and ketchup for my fries and more butter. So yeah, and then this is also my shrimp. I think this is my, ooh, hold on. And I got a Sprite and I'm still drinking my wine. So I'm about to grab. I'm kind of glad it came an hour later, but... I'm so excited. It makes me sad that Aretha's gone. And there's no but to that. It makes me sad that Aretha's gone. Damn, excited for this movie though. Because I love movies about people's lives especially icons. I'm excited. 
You guys, this crab is disgusting. I'm not picky. This crab is disgusting. International act. I hate how we just have one, but oh well. I don't know who that is. I don't know who the South African person is. Dave, I've heard of Dave. Stormzy, I've heard of Stormzy. Nino, have not. Caprijo. That's it. And the BT board goes to. Oh, I miss Berna because I was like, where? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Berna boy. Yeah. I'm not Nigerian, but I'm glad he's here to accept his award this time. <laughs> if you guys watched, what was it, last year? He was not there. Am I missing a crab leg? I'm about to give them a really bad <laughs> review. There's like no meat in here. It's cold. I'm missing a crab leg. Like, why is that black there? Okay, Kirk Franklin's here. Are we having a gospel performance? Because we usually have a gospel performance every BET Awards. And so I would still appreciate a gospel performance. We're doing Wayne Grady? Oh, Wayne Brady's um, doing a tribute for a Little Richard. So I just wrote my review. I don't know if you can see. I just wrote my review to Uber Eats for my order because it was disgusting. I've never had something that was this bad from Red Lobster. Even delivered in store, like or in the restaurant, sitting down, nothing. I'm so upset. Wayne Brady's doing a good job. I don't think it's Little Richard enough, though. You know, but he's doing a great job. I just don't like the person he's emulating. He could just be a little more, you know. I don't know. Oh my gosh, there's a stain on my pants. Well, all the people that passed away this year. I hate this part. Juice World. Betty Wright. Oh, Roger Mayweather. Huey. Oh my gosh, they added Huey in time. You have to have the goat do the goat. Okay, Little Wayne doing the Kobe tribute. Album of the year. And the winner is. Please excuse me for being antisocial. Who are you? Cute. Okay. I mean, his song was number one for weeks. So I guess. Wouldn't be my choice, but yeah. They're pop. R&B and pop is crossing over, which is why I guess they put it together, or has it always been together? R&B and pop. Janae. Yes. Oh my God. Janae had a really good album, but Lizzo did too. So. Fuck you, Lizzie. I'm saying they all should win, but no. Lizzo for sure. Alicia is wearing makeup. I know this for a fact. You can't see her freckles. So is the makeup fast over? Not that it, um Yeah, so is the makeup fast over? Not that there's anything wrong with wearing makeup, because duh. But you know, she swore it off makeup, so just wondering. Hey, this is my. He's awake, so he knows what he's doing. Do it, do it, and this is how we do it. 
do it, do it. Good job, Chloe and oh, Hallie. Hey. I do think their other live performances have been better than this one, but it was good. It looks like they allowed her to come into the BET Center and record this. Hey. She went alto there and I wasn't expecting that. An unequal system. We have to continue to do this together. Continue to fight for each other and lift each other up. Because there are people banking on us staying at home during local elections and primaries happening in states across the country. Mm -hmm. We have to vote. And Beyonce tells you to pull up, you better pull up and vote. A journey. Oh, was there a performance? Beyonce over <laughs> I didn't even realize that was a commercial. Oh my goodness, I need to rewatch that. I thought it was about to be a whole thing. Okay, I um, had to switch to my phone because my because my camera died. Um, so yeah, debriefing it was it felt very short, um, just because there wasn't those moments that is just like live moments where you know people are really into the music. You see the celebrities into the songs. You see people interacting. It's just. It just, it, that wasn't there, of course. It's a virtual show, but. And they didn't, just like in, in the regular award show, they didn't show that many people that won awards. And I'm like, okay, I give the excuse during the award show that there's just too many performances and things like that. But this time, it's like, okay, you guys have the time. Show the awards. You showed the same things, or even less yeah um, it was cool megan's performance still my favorite chloe and hallie did that um roddy rich performed twice other than that yeah overall it wasn't fulfilling <laughs> i can't wait till we get back to life after quarantine because hopefully we can get award shows like this back. We can be in bigger spaces with more people. Hopefully. Hopefully that's what we can get back to that. Um, definitely no life is going to be different, but hopefully we can get back to that because this ciao, ciao. And my food wasn't even good. <sighs> But thank you so much for following me through this day, and I hope you enjoyed it. I don't know if it was boring or not, but I had a good time, and so I hope you did too. I hope you enjoyed the BET Awards. I hope you watched it. If not, I hope you liked some of my reactions to it. I didn't have much. All right. Good night, y'all. Thank you for watching. My name is AC Coakley, and don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share, all that jazz. Love you guys.